yeah, check this out, man. I just want to, you ain't going to be in on here, but, but for a few minutes, man. I just wanted to speak on the, on the C-Mac situation, man. You know what I'm saying? For one, you know, I'm, I'm real familiar with DPs. I didn't have quite a few, you know what I'm saying, guys dp in my day that was in violation. You know what I'm saying? But never have I even seen a guy get DP'd on me for some shit that happened when he wasn't even in the gang that he in. You know what I'm saying? On some real how you going to DP for some shit happened before he even joined the gang, your gang? You know what I'm saying? It's some real shit, man. And when it come to C-Mac, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm not off down with all the shit he do, but you know, man, the, the dude got good heart, man. You know what I'm saying? The dude just misled his himself. He just really needs some guidance, man. And whoever over there guiding him, with him you know what I'm saying? They, doing, they ain't guiding him the right way. You know, because ain't no way he's supposed to got DP, man. I think that's just some jealous all this shit on me from some people that is jealous of what he's doing and jealous because he's getting some money. That's some in-house shit, man. They, they wasn't supposed to DP that, man. He ain't told on nobody. He ain't snitched on nobody. That little shit they talking about he disrespected or claimed another. Man, there's plenty of shit that claimed no. They knew he was from another hood before he even got in their hood. They knew that. You know, so that's some bullshit. You know, I think they just jealous of that man. Somebody over there jealous of that man. And you know what I'm saying? But listen, man. The man put my five on the map, all putting that hood on the map all over the world. Ain't nobody, no, he ain't no shot caller over there, nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Snoop wasn't no shot caller, but he put the, the Long Beach 20s on the map all over the world. And this man is putting 5-5 five, five on the world, man. So why y'all want to do this, man? Come on, man. Why, you know, why Why y'all do that man like that, man? Y'all didn't have to be with man like that. And then I'm going to tell you another thing, man. Whoever who, whichever one of their homeboys put the little shit on the internet when they picking him up off them and all that other shit, he need to be DP. You know what I'm saying? Because that's supposed to be some in-house shit. Ain't nobody supposed to saw that. That shit wasn't even supposed to be. Man, man, motherfucker wasn't even supposed to know he is getting DP for real, for real. If they was going to do it the right way, the OG way. They Being right, some niggas in the comments were saying like, oh, it's, it was going to get out anyway. And this, that, and the third, I think they were saying that because C-Mac had posted, you know, the uh, the, vid, the live he posted, nigga, the aftermath or whatever the case is. But nigga, I'm sure, nigga, he seen niggas in the, nigga, while you down there or whatever the case is, when, you know, the video where he was on the ground and shit, man. Niggas, I'm sure, nigga, he seen niggas recording and hearing niggas going, he heard the nigga go over there and tell like, nigga, you from the hood still, what is you doing? So, I'm sure nigga seen that nigga like, let me get ahead of it, you know what I mean, or whatever. They just supposed to call them to the hood, DP them, and that was it. It wasn't nobody else's business. On some real shit. You know what I'm saying? But they, you know, whoever it was that's hating on him, they want the world to see that he got beat DP, that he got fucked up, and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? They hood is cool, but it ain't like they no big ass hood or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? I got homies from over there that's from that hood. You know what I'm saying? But then the other day, man, somebody fucked up on this one, man. Somebody dropped the ball. Man, see? Hey, and they, hey, so we getting some insight from, you know, an OG that's out there in Southern California, nigga. And to get the insight, to, like I said, man, I've been doing, you know, going to listen to what everybody got to say, niggas that's out there, nigga, on the, on the turf, right? So, nigga... It's and it's right. It's really no different from any other hood, bro, nigga. You already know how this shit really go, and it's a trip, right? Cause he DT mentioned something. He said, nigga, whoever was recording a video, why, 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 uh, niggas ain't trying to get that sorted out or whatever the case is, right? I don't want that to be the case for the nigga, right? Nigga, I want niggas to be nigga, bro, going to do something else, man. Whatever, man, getting to do that, nigga, do YouTube, nigga, and just whatever, whatever you gotta do, but. It's a cold situation, man. Like, nigga, you feel me? Like, nigga, bro, I don't know. So, we gonna get into this, uh, we gonna get into this CML situation, right?
we got WAC 100 and CML. Uh, nigga, apparently, right, WAC 100. We gonna let we gonna I'm a I'm gonna let WAC 100 tell y'all. sentiment right if we've been hearing what the nigga been saying it's been seeming like he been blackballed right from his perspective nigga you know so 
you know, another door being shut, like, right, kind of like, um, due to, due to these politics, nigga can only, you know what I mean, can only start to get frustrated, you know? A bullshit ass weird wall, though. Listen, I stopped my, my, he did a diss song back. I went to the studio and deleted the motherfucking stop you from putting it out. They know I stopped you from putting it out. They got mad and said, why'd you do that? I said, because I fuck with Mozzie. And I'm going to advise him, nephew. The nigga hating on you because of who you are in the game. Your fans don't pay him no attention. The minute you bite into that and drop, now your fans is going to pay him some attention. Nigga, the art of war, nigga, is to destroy on every level. You can't put that out. Mozzie didn't talk to me for two, three months. He was mad at him up, but I deleted the whole files, everything. Call he didn't call me what? and said, huh? He called me and said, huh? I thought about it. I'm glad I didn't put it out you right. He said, I need more niggas like you around me, huh? Because you, you didn't give a fuck that even though I wasn't talking to you, wasn't returning your call, you never sent me a fucked up text message. You never got mad, said nothing. I said, you know, that's what I'm here for. That's the real definition of a G homie to you. That's right. You know what I mean? So, you know. Uh, and, and then they called me. I think I spoke on it. I spoke on it and said, the diss track will not be responded to. I deleted it. I Ooh. Hey, man. Whew. Y'all niggas want to see that full live, right? Go to Skin Down ENT, and you're going to be able to see the whole clubhouse conversation. Uh, Y'all. <laughs> you know the cold thing about it is, man. Whack, he touched on a lot in this little small clip, and it's a cold clip because, right? You know, y'all gotta understand that. You know, for a long time, CML was kind of like, you know, on restriction as far as it goes when it comes to talking about the Mozzie situation or even saying his name and or doing any of that because he was on probation, right? And then, uh, you know, he kind of felt like Mozzie elevated his career off the back of him right i'm talking about cml so when he finally got a chance to be able to speak back and say his piece or whatever the case is or try to use um the 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 feud between the two right as like um some type some form of marketing hey we got whack 100 coming in deleting this songs you know what I'm saying? And what's crazy is, right, it's two ways you can look at that. We're going to look at it from CML perspective. Then we're going to look at it from my perspective. From CML perspective, right, you got to be like, okay, man, this what I'm up against it. You know what I mean? As far as it goes when it comes to, like, the industry, right? So you got to, man, it's like you got to really try to figure out how to navigate. And it's split. The, na the industry... It's split, man. It's a, it's a cold split, right? But some niggas, man, is just connected, and it's a cold situation, right? Um, so, but the whole point of him going back, right, and doing, you know, well, doubling back and making Where's Waldo 2, nigga, was to try to use the, you know what I mean? The, the, the fuel between the two, the fuel between the fuel between the two, right? And, and, and propel his career, you know what I mean? Because, nigga, he know that Mozzie didn't, got here he on a hole he on a he on he on a, he getting to that next level to where he almost yeah you understand me and why uh uh whack 100 was actually explaining this uh i think on this same live i don't know but he was explaining like that mozzie is almost up out of here you know what i mean so and he already up out of here you know what i mean so he talking about that next next level but from mozzie perspective it definitely was a a g move right a move that 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 you know, um, you know, can be definitely much appreciated right in time. Cause like he said, he was mad for three months, but then when if you know, when he finally got a chance to like get his thoughts together and this, that, and the third, he was like, man, that was, you know, you right, man. If you definitely, if you want to, it's crazy. Cause 50 be talking about this a lot, nigga, about crushing his opponents completely. You know what I mean? So man, uh, here, there you have it, man. We got, nigga, we got to just see how it play out man and see how cml is gonna navigate through all this and actually we gotta see nigga where how mozzy gonna uh navigate and and trying to you know like um still let it be known because you know that's what the supporters definitely be feeding off of too you know in, in the midst of you trying to elevate your career you definitely can't forget where you came from right and that be them niggas who ignorant they definitely want to hear what you got to say as far as like 
the situations, right? But in time, right, things do die down, man, and people do forget. So WAC 100, man, might be, might be an asset, you know what I mean, on real talk. Not might be, WAC 100 is an asset, you feel me? As far as, like, Mozzie goes and this, that, and the third, but... Yeah, man, it's a cold situation, man. I wonder how, how you're going to feel about hearing this. You know what I'm saying? Uh, at least y'all know, like, in the in the industry and this, then, and the third, people are still people, man. So, niggas is going, you know, you make somebody upset and this, that, and the third, hey, they might try to, yeah, they're going to be like, nigga, you ain't finna eat or whatever. That ain't the case with CML, you know what I'm saying? Because a nigga going crazy. I'm just saying for a nigga who might not, who might not, uh, you know, have these uh, other skills, nigga. But yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think, bro. What y'all let me, let me, what y'all think about, you know what I mean? Well, WAC 100 did deleting a diss song. Niggas definitely wanted to hear that. So I know niggas is hot, you know, but y'all let me know what y'all think about that. And let, you, let me know what y'all think about OG and T and, uh, and his bust down and how, he, you know, his insight on the C Mac situation, man. It's gang. I don't give a fuck, Keisha. Fake gang. Motherfuckers be showing all that fake ass love. Keep that shit away from me. Keep that fake ass shit away from me, nigga. For I explode on one of you bitch ass niggas, nigga. Say yo, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that paper, need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, I can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that paper, need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Like a greater hoe, don't play me like no sin, cause I never kept the save a hoe. 